Hello everybody, I'm back with another video and today I'm gonna do a uh, flip through of this art journal. So this is my journal number 13 and uh, this is how fat it ended up looking. There's, As you can see there's a lot going on with it. So I'm excited to show you and let's get started. So like always, if I don't feel comfortable with showing um, like a part of the journal, I'm not because I'm trying to do more of actual journaling and uh, writing my thoughts and things like that. And I don't want that out and about <laughs> on the internet. So I'll probably cover those up. But yeah, this is a moleskin uh, pocket notebook. At first, I didn't like the paper but then as you work on it like you get used to it and it's like whatever unless you do a lot of uh, paint and wet and you use a lot of wet media on your journals I wouldn't recommend it um, but if not then it's it's probably fine uh, my best friend gave me these stickers and this is frame back and my girls from twice Like I said, this is the 13th uh, journal. Uh, it was my Halloween journal, and I took life to finish this. Uh, I started on this on September 15th and ended this on January 3rd. So it's, it's, it's a long last time. I don't know how many pages this has, honestly, for me to be like, oh, well, I took a long time or not. But yeah, uh, this is a picture that I did a project here with them. And uh, it was left over, so I left it here. The first art journal, I think this journal only has three art journals, or maybe four, I don't remember. But this is the first one, which I really, really like how it turned out. Um, I like the colors and like the color palette and things like that. So I really appreciate how this one came out. Really pretty stuff. I mean, what can I say? I did it, you know. <laughs> Here was our work for uh, this is de September, uh, which is like a Mexican holiday since we live in the border. We our work we pretty much celebrated, um, and they left me. They let me wear my Mexico jersey. So it's always fun when I can wear jerseys at work. Um, and we had a seasonal that <laughs> didn't even last, but like we're like, ah, dude, come here, let's eat. So yeah, uh, he would. He would I was doing an illustration, so. Here I was watching the colors and what um, color pencil I can use to do the shadows. So that's what this is. What is this here? <laughs> oh, this is this is my birthday. Um, super cute. This is everything that I that I got. Uh, this is one of my best friend gave me which was amazing i finally got my momo not ready to be uh cd uh, here are the stickers that i got ah, this is the one that i got right here um some photo cards and it was just the cutest thing i got this cake at work which is cute uh, my brother gave me this little shomaru and this frame shirt that I love. Um, this is me at work, then me with my family, and then my two dinners and things like that. It was a pretty sweet birthday. Uh, here's the social room that Joshua, my brother, gave me. Um, and this is what I like to do now that I have, uh, if I get anything, like any toy or any figure or whatever, I just like to put the packaging so I, I have it there that, you know, I used to have the packaging and things like that. So yeah, I have this. Oh, this was for, I think it was when McDonald's had the the happy meal and it was pokemon um what the f oh, 
Um, and usually we get McDonald's for dinner, like when we do. And my dad likes to get Happy Meals. So we had Pokemon. And I was excited because I got Sprigatito, which was my starter on Pokemon Scarlet. So yeah, they had like this, these stickers, and then I saved the pack and everything. So here it is. And since I don't play Pokemon or anything like that, I just put them in my journal. Other shows that I was watching back when this was going on, I did this, and then I finished whatever I finished, and I had that. Uh, so I'm still working on fairy tale. <laughs> uh, Salary Man's Club is pretty good. Then I have the Lion Guard, Kaku Ranger, Trigon, Bleach. Oh, I miss Bleach. Bring it back already. Uh, Jujutsu Kaisen, also bring it back. And King Onja, which uh, we're still watching. And here was the same, but what did I finish? That is not here. Fairy Kaku Ranger. Oh, where's the Trigon? So I finished Trigon and I started Eat Man. Uh, so I always like to keep track of what I'm watching, like the shows. Uh, so that's what I was currently watching, which uh, Fairy Tail are working on. Uh, these two are already done, Kaku Ranger 2. Uh, please, Bleach, come back. The Thousand Blood uh, War, uh, which was, uh, I guess, going on at that time. Jujutsu Kaisen, and which was the new season, season two, and which is the center that I'm currently watch watching, which is King Onja. I'm enjoying it. They give me this gift card for what? My birthday? Yeah, my manager gave me give gift gifted me that for my birthday. I don't know. Um I really really like this show Terror and Resonance. Um the, I wasn't expecting the ending honestly. And uh That's all I gotta say. <laughs> Like, if you haven't watched it, and if you like anime, uh, it's really, really good. I really liked it, and it's pretty short. So, and, I, and I'm glad it just wrapped up and, and everything. Like, it's, it's it's really good. I really enjoyed it. Oh, here we went to see It Lives Inside. A uh, really good movie. I really enjoyed it as well. Went to the Animal Draft House. Me and my best friend to watch it and it was fun fun times i really liked it i like the movie um here i got this two why did i get those two a tombow and a cool pick sketch i don't know but i got them and here i'm, I'm swatching them and i got some washing probably from timu so i got it there uh searching for my art journal which I usually just do it in a little strip and then I lose in and then whatever. This is how I'm gonna do it now. Um, if I need to swatch for anything. Here, um, I'm trying to do more daily journals. And uh, this is one of them. I mean, I can't, I, literally cannot do like a, a daily art journal that's for sure but when i get inspired i do like to do them and i don't know if i should record them as well because they're very quick and uh i try to make it with less planning than an actual art journal that i work on because if not it's gonna take me forever uh but it was just like a, a drawing and like some art like journaling things and this is the these are the supplies that I already have on hand, like separated for the actual art journals, like things that um, I haven't used or that are the leftovers of the project that I did. So I don't um, go and fetch new ones. So that's what I try to do here. But I think I should record them. 
Oh, here's another one of my art journals, uh, which I really, really, really like. I usually don't do blue with green, so this was a nice change of pace of uh, color palettes because I feel like sometimes I repeat a lot of color palettes, and that's not what I want to do. Uh, but yeah, here it is. Here it is, and I really like it. Tell me if you do. Well, tell me if you if you follow me if you watch this video. I'll probably link all, all these. Um. Oh yeah, when Freem Becky went to Japan, and uh, like it says there, I totally miscalculated <laughs> when <laughs> um, the day. So I thought that it was gonna be okay. So it was. It, this was the day that they they had it. I think at. They had it in the afternoon. I, I, um, Japan is 14 hours ahead of my time. Um, but I think they were telling us, like, oh, it's gonna be at this time in Thailand, which is 12 hours ahead. And I was like, oh, cool. And I thought that it was gonna be on this day in the, uh, like, in, on this, I, I technically thought it was gonna be on the 8th instead of the 7th and I, I had off on like I don't know what day but here I wasn't off the next day and I already bought the ticket for the live stream and I saw that it because with some of their live streams you can see later you can watch them later like whenever you have time but this one they weren't gonna do that and I was like dude I'm gonna have to like wake up and watch this which I did um I really like it was super cute I really enjoyed it the only thing was that the translator was not it so like I was speaking in Thai and in, in Japanese and I swore I could I could understand that better than the English translator and I was like this is a problem <laughs> so I should have just left it in Thai and pray for the best but other than that it was so cool um and here's a picture of my girls love them so much they look so cute Uh, here we we watched the uh, The Exorcist Believer. Uh, this was supposed to be a receipt, and it's dead now. <laughs> um, I felt like I liked it. It was, uh, you know, it was, it was cool, it was whatever. But I thought the pacing was kind of weird. Um, I don't know how to explain it. I feel like the original movie dragged on at the beginning, which I, I guess you have to know that backstory right or whatever but i feel like here it was like too much like i don't know how to explain it either and too fast <laughs> but i mean it was fine it, was, it wasn't like dog shit or anything i'm sorry uh, this is uh, another attempt at a daily art journal i saw this and i really liked it so i printed it out and then i had some oil pastels and I thought it would look good like that which in theory I'm like it's okay but I um, don't I don't like it as much but like whatever you know you live and you learn <laughs> like it's not my favorite and if I would have and I thought of recording this one like which is my second one and I'm glad I didn't because I don't like it <laughs> but we live and learn Oh, this is some kanji that I was trying to learn Japanese and that uh, shit's hard um, but once you're reading you're oh, oh sorry you're kind of glad that it's written like this and not in like hiragana or katagana because it's like pff, like a big ass word and it's just like oh if I can just look at this and that's yama you know or shit like that like I, I get it <laughs> I get where they're going from and sometimes when you're reading it it's like I'm glad that I can read this kanji so it's not like Nihon no you just watch you just read this and you're like ah cool or see how like Tokyo it's like it's just these two and you know what you're talking about so sometimes like I, I get whatever I can see I can see the vision 
uh for this once i finished the original trigon because i watched uh the stampede like the newest anime and i mean according to myself i already watched it but like it, it, it's like if, if i was watching it for the first time because i didn't remember shit so i enjoyed it i mean i enjoyed it the first time i watched it this time that i watched it um even though i didn't remember anything i <laughs> It's, it's it's a good show. Oh, and I'm out of frame. Here you go. This is uh, what was it called? Oh, right here. Salary Man Club. Yeah. So this is a sports anime, but like, what's cool about it is that it's, they're not high schoolers. They're um like they're already working adults and they're in a company and they play uh badminton which I, you know it's pretty cool um just their stories are pretty cool and i just hate when uh, they make them so short like this is i think it's 12 episodes and you just want to see more of what they're up to you know but i enjoyed it a lot i like those kind of animes i got a sukuna so here here he is here he is Oh, and I got Gio's uh, album, solo album, and they have stickers, so I got them here. And since every it's three albums, well, four with the little one, um, but the three of the big ones have like the same stickers. So I was like, oh, I'm just gonna use this as a spread. Uh, this apparently is a bookmark. I, I thought it was like a standing little Gio thing. Apparently, so it's a bookmark. But um, I already had her, so I was like, oh, I'll just paste it here. And I bought one at Walmart and one at Target, and the other one I think at Target, two? I don't know. But yes, this is super cute, and I love Gio. Mm. I'm still, still working on Fairy Tail. Still a Kaku Ranger. I took life with Kaku Ranger. Um, a fish. See, this is where the holiday started working because um, I just finished this one and it's not that long, it's just 24 episodes, but like I just cut it. Um, we're still watching King Monja, Jutsu Kaisen, and things like that. This is uh, a, a daily one of the daily journals that I was talking about that I wish I would have recorded because I really, really like how it turned out. It looks like some of my regular um, art journals that I make, and uh, that's also something I don't want. But it just came out like that, and it looks super pretty. Uh, maybe because it's something I'm used to working on. So yeah, but this I do wish I, could, I would have recorded it because I really liked it. Oh, I was so excited for my. Um, book one fine day with friend becky oh my god that shit ever <laughs> so worth it i i don't know how much it was a hundred and something who cares this is serotonin right here uh there were some photo cards that came on this little thing but i kept it because it had this and i put this little this little sticker of them little picture them being super cute some of my favorite from the photo shoot um just <laughs> Christ. Um I love them. <laughs> and uh if you're out there just watch Gap. Gap the series. Ten out of ten. Love my girls. Um and this is they had some letters that they dedicated to each other and this is the English translation because of course it wasn't Thai. So there's that. What um for her and for her. And then here I got this magazine, which I thought came with a photo card. And although all it didn't, it came with a postcard. It was like this big or so. Um, but here's some of the pictures that I liked of that photo shoot. Uh, here is another art journal that I that I did. I guess this one had four journal art journals. Um. I don't know if the color palette. I don't know what I was trying to do. 
Unless I just make him, I'm like, oh, well. but all together, I do like how it came out. I like this cutie, and that's all that matters. Oh, these are my art supplies for for fall. Um, what did I get from Singapore? Oh yeah, I bought, I bought a cold book marker and on Amazon and it came from all the fuck way on, from Singapore and I was like, what? I know I was gonna travel places, you know, I thought it was just, I did just had it here in the US, but whatever. So I thought it was cool, so I, I got it. <laughs> so yeah, this was all of the colors that I used for the fall and I did do a video about it. And... Uh, that's pretty much what I used. And I just got an art journal snack, so I'm gonna record another video for that. For that and for my art supplies for the winter. Uh, here, for here, I was just talking about how it was boss day and they, like we got food. I forgot what we got, honestly. Also made, made uh, lasagna and it was so fucking good. And they gave me this cup, which I drew on, I have right here. Show and tell. It's huge, cause it's so dead, but yeah. But I, I, I drew it right there. Uh, here, there's a food truck that opened up. It's selling the, the Korean corn dogs and the, um, some mini pancakes with like Nutella and strawberries. So me and my best friend got it. Even though we we had some like tacos for dinner and then we went there, it was too much, <laughs> too much food. But um, the pancakes were really good. I mean, that one that was good too, but we didn't finish it because it was a lot of food. And here I was swatching for like whatever, God knows who what. Oh, and this is the uh, Pokemon event from work. So since we have Toys R Us and then. It's Jeffrey's birthday, like every day there's like a celebration and one day was Pokemon and my friend from work, because I was off and she was like, dude, I'm gonna go get you a Pokemon like thing and I was like, yes, please. So I got it. <laughs> I got it. Let's see. Look how cute. This was, ah. this was the cards that I got. Magneton. And then this was super cute. I really like him. And I wish he was my starter in Scarlet Don't Tell. Spiro got Tito or whatever his name is. But yes. These. Let's see. It's a little pamphlet or whatever. And then these, they had a little pocket, so I just pasted it so I can put my extra cards here. My friend got me this this because she thought it was cute. These two because she thought it was cute. Like after these. Oh, what? What was this? Oh, the twice, um, the official fan club. And I'm like, I am unofficial ones so i'm gonna buy it and and i did and here we are i forgot what was the tamagotchi here i think so the tamagotchi you can put some one of these uh which i have in my backpack but i um i have in there only three fits so i have my main three which is momo momo geo and dion um so i put them there and the rest are here it took me a minute. I was like, I don't want to put them there. I was like, what else are you going to do with them? So I just, I was like, my journal is important to me. So I just put them there. And this was some cute uh, stickers of the members. And like I said, they're my main three. And then, Sana, Nile, Choyong, Mina, Cheong, and Chewy. And here they are again. 
and this is another art journal i don't know how i feel about this one tbh this that i did here with the um oil pastel i don't know if i'm digging honestly and afterwards i'll say mm -hmm, not your best work because <laughs> it really isn't um I don't know, I don't think it's a strong journal. Oh well, yeah, my, my, my store uh, was first place in something I didn't think I was gonna get first place because we're just a small store and they were grading the, the packing rooms and mine is not like, wow, I mean, it could be better, but we won first place and we got 200 bucks, so we used it to a little luncheon or whatever and this is um our back of house team having fun making friends and here's some of us some pictures of that and it was like near halloween so that's why i have these this was all the food fun times fun times another um daily journal that i wish i would have recorded this is more what i'm like looking to achieve like it has a drawing that's directly on the paper and uh, I'm still using the stickers and things like that but this is kind of what, what I'm going for and I really like this one and like I said I wish I would record that, that that one as well I would just get this one from work so I just pasted it here with this that I wasn't gonna use and then we also got oh my goodness. The Macy stone, which is right here. Oh no, they put away the rest of my keys, but this one I think was too much. Um, some shoes that I got, uh, a few notes, thingy, and whatever. <laughs> this, is, this is like the most random ass spread. Not this, but like. Uh, honestly, I was just putting whatever in here. <laughs> here it's when they had the free cup the free cup day and uh, I, I, at that time I, I wanted late I wanted them given and I told one of the girls in my in my team I was like dude if you go get them I'll get your drinks and she was like yeah so then I got them good drinks and they had like their holiday their holiday cup and then I cut up the bag where we had them so I can make this and the background or whatever so yeah have my cup this one was fun i really really liked it um it made me remember that i have the i have the book that i haven't even opened it i haven't done anything with it i did read the first three i mean the original three but hello i should get to this at some point My 10th Thanksgiving plate. Ayy. I don't know what else to put, so I drew Frank's eye because she had like this cute makeup thing going on. So I wanted to draw that. I really like her eyes. Um, so I just did the quick little doodle of that. I bought a twice uh, CD. And I just made this like a little twice thing. Here, it was a fan meeting in Taiwan for Freen Beck. This is what Freen told her, which I thought was cute, so I put it there. And I always like when they are like, oh, do you have anything to say to the other person? Uh, it's always cute, so. I like to write it because it's cute. So here it is. <laughs> and finally done. This is the last art journal, which I think is kind of busy, but I really like how it turned out. Not gonna lie, I think it's fun. Um, and I, I took life to finish this journal. <laughs> but this one I did. Um, 
finished on the but since I was waiting to do an art journal I started this on December uh, so this is already kind of fat which great place to introduce it here is my field notes that I'm currently using and I've done this much and I have to start it like art journal wise I haven't done an art journal here and my dog is playing so yes I'm done this was a great book uh, this is the final spread I did <laughs> one more by accident so I just pasted there and my gloss the end but yeah one of my favorite journals honestly I like how fat it is I really like um, I had fun working on this I think I had a lot of like papers and things which is what I want from my journal I want to put the most that I can on these and I think I achieved on this and I hope I can keep going on the other one so I hope you liked this video and if you did tell me if you also do some journaling tell me, tell me how you do it I always like to know what anybody else is doing so yeah i hope you enjoy see you guys in the next one bye, -bye.